How to get rid of Nostoc algae. Those firm, gelatinous spots on the soggier parts of your property are Nostoc algae. Nostoc algae thrives in overwatered or consistently moist, sunny areas. Although it is not hazardous to plants or animals, it is terribly unattractive. There are several ways to combat a Nostoc algae problem. Chemical control options provide a quick fix, but cultural control is the most reliable way to win the long-term battle against Nostoc algae. Things you'll need Sand Fungicide Raise the grade in affected areas, and increase drainage by mixing a 3-4 to four inch layer of sand into the top 6-8 to eight inches of the soil. Nostoc algae needs standing water and consistent moisture to thrive. The sand will allow the water to filter down the lower levels of the soil where Nostoc algae will not grow. Assess your plant's water needs. Overwatering is a common cause of Nostoc algae proliferation. Most garden and lawn plants only need 1 inch too in hot, dry weather of water during weeks in which there has been no rain. Watering daily and or watering so much that puddles form on the soil surface is not only bad for most plants, but leads to the proliferation of fungi and algae like Nostoc. Assess your garden or lawn's fertilization needs. High phosphorus levels in the soil, due to over-fertilization or fertilizer or manure runoff from neighboring areas, can lead to the proliferation of Nostoc algae. Before you fertilize your lawn or garden, test the soil through your local county extension office or with a home test kit available at most home and garden centers. The results will tell you exactly how much fertilizer is necessary for your land. Do not exceed these amounts. Apply a fungicide. Cultural controls are not suitable for every area. And even in suitable areas, chemical control can get rid of the initial infestation while you work on preventing the problem from recurring. Dr. Philip Kolbaugh, turf grass pathologist writing for GroundsMaintenance.com, recommends applying a chlorothalonil or mancozeb-based fungicide to the infested area once every 7 to 14 days until the Nostoc is killed usually 2 to 3 rounds of application will do it. Follow the manufacturer's instructions and apply the fungicide at the lowest application rate for newly established infestations. Tackle thick mats of Nostoc algae with the highest listed application rate. These fungicides work best if the ground is as dry as possible at the time of application. If cultural moisture control is not an option, continued application every 14 days at the lowest application rate may prevent another infestation from occurring.